Sir Goldie Spark, how are we supposed to raid this Halo ring with no weapons? Obviously you'll need to go buy some. The world has been ravaged by a massive war and you expect us to just go buy weapons? What store would still be open? Silly Arbiter, there's one store that will always be open no matter how destroyed the world is. Walmart. <laughs> can seriously be going to Walmart. Okay viewers, today we are going to Walmart. Yep, we're seriously going to Walmart. As you arrive at a fine shopping establishment like Walmart, you'll realize parking is different than at McDonald's or a restaurant. You'll notice a large amount of small white children running around with shopping carts. When you do manage to park, walk into the store. You'll be greeted by an undead zombie posing as an employee. After you get a cart, try to weave your way through oh, the Oh, I'm happy for you, and I'ma let you finish, but this episode is called Master Chief Sucks at Shopping, not the Arbiter Sucks at Shopping. Keep your trap shut. Anyway, once you get a cart, you'll have to weave your way through hundreds of fat white women, little white children, and redneck white guys. You may be noticing a trend here, everyone at Walmart is white. This is because of an obscure Jim Crow law that prevents minorities from shopping here. I don't think that's accurate. Didn't I just tell you to shut the fuck up? Anyway, we're going to be buying weapons. Weapons are plentiful here at Walmart because people need to stock up to make sure the government doesn't take their land. Hello there, I'd like to buy an assault rifle. Okay. Do you have registration? We need registration. I don't think we have any. I've got an idea. Hey everyone listen to this guy's high-pitched voice. I think you might be gay. What? I'm not gay. This man is a threat to the sanctity of marriage. Kill him. <laughs> Alright, let's quickly grab some weapons. Okay, well one loaded up. I think we're good. Let's get out of here before this mob kills everyone. Hey look, I'm I game, and what again Fox Sex Simulator. We don't have time for this chief, let's go. Let me get this straight. We're getting help from the past version of the man who just tried to kill us? He doesn't want to kill us yet. Why not? Because Master Chief hasn't told me to leave McDonald's. Hello there. May I take your order? Are you Biff? Oh, you're some McDonald's employee. I'm Master Chief and I suggest hauling your ass out of this joint. So I should get a job elsewhere? Take my word, your life will improve greatly when you ditch this oh crap. Hey, nice costume. You mind, if I borrow the idea? No, go right ahead. So King, what can I do for you? And you wouldn't happen to know anything about that employee who just quit, would you? How does this past Ronald already know you? He was time traveling once, and bumped into me anyway. Ronald, we were sent back in time by someone, who definitely wasn't you, and we need some help getting back. Sure, I think I can help. Alright, so we've got our weapons. I guess we should go to the Halo now. Hello again, Reclaimer. I accessed the Halo's database, and I have good news and bad news. The bad news, your friend Cortana is dead. Fucking hell. Shit, what's the good news? The good news is, because she is an AI, she can't really die if someone retrieves her reboot codes in time. Her sister program, an AI called the Senator, was able to do so right as the Ark exploded. Cortana and the Senator, who you know as Hillary Clinton, have the reboot codes stored on the Halo. The reboot codes are guarded by a program called the Governor. You must negotiate her release. Don't worry, we're good at negotiating. 
We're all so good at killing people who don't give us what we want. Alright, let's do this. Your friends are coming for you, you know. They better be prepared for a fight. Don't worry, they will be. <laughs> 